Hello everyone, and welcome again to Eloquent Gaming. And tonight I am in Eastern Karana. I am soloing Crag Spiders. And these guys are pretty nice because they are blue to me. And, uh,. They also give out lots and lots of silk, which is nice because um, I'm using it to uh, my tailoring. And uh, I'm using the the same technique I used before with the bandits, where uh, I root them, and then I dot them with uh, both my stinging swarm and my flame lick, and then sit down to met up. Um, there's also a shaman that's doing the exact same thing, and it's been nice because we've been kind of watching each other's back. But yeah, each one of them gives, I don't know, anywhere between four and eight silks. And so in doing this, I've gotten my uh, tailoring, I think, all the way up to like 16 or something like that. So. But yeah, the biggest trouble with these is um, if you get any ads, it can really be a problem. Um, which is why it's nice if you have somebody kind of hunting in the same area, they can uh, help with any ads. Um, and it's also why I'm pulling where I am right down the gorge from High Pass. Because um, that way there's not as much traffic. Um, and if you really needed to with... Uh, with Spirit of the Wolf on, you can kind of hop up the gorge real quick and, and make it into High Pass without much trouble. And then uh, once I get them down to about 30 to 20, I hit them with a careless lighting like this. finishes them off. Um, but for where I am right now, they do hit kind of hard. Um, so you have to be a little careful. But um, usually as long as you get one, it's, it's not that big of a deal. And then while I'm metting up, I'm going to open up my tailor kit. Try making some uh, some silk swatches, and I'm just up to 14. And I think the next time that I run into town, I'll grab some patterns and try making 
um, some actual items um, to get that up more. But um, for right now, I've been kind of doing this. Um, I've gotten, I don't know, I've been here for about maybe two or three hours, and I've gotten, I don't know, maybe three golds, which isn't too bad. Um, but with this, the uh, the med break that you need to take is, is kind of long, because just in case you do get in any trouble, um, it's nice to have full mana. Um, so that way if you do get an ad, you can root both of them and uh, make your escape up the gorge or maybe out to the bridge, whichever you feel is closest. But, uh, yeah, you just have to kind of watch your back because there are griffons that come down, although most of them are kind of kind of low to me, so they're kind of leaving me alone right now. Um, but, uh, on my walk over, I did see a, uh, a nightwalker, some kind of black wolf, and that kind of blew to me and was ready to attack, so, um, if he ended up getting on my back without me noticing it, that, that would be a bad ad as well, but, um, but yeah, where I am right here, it's, uh, it's not too bad as long as I can pull them back into here. There aren't too many crag spiders that hang out here, so. But, um, yeah, I don't know. I'm hoping to, uh, stay here until, um, I get, uh, my next level. And then I think I'm going to stop soloing for a little bit, because... As nice as the experience is, it's it's getting a little old. Um, unfortunately, I don't know where to go next. Um, I spent a night or two trying to find a group in Unrest, and right now Unrest seems extremely busy. Um, and oddly enough, High Pass, every time I check High Pass, No, well, there's a few, but um, it's been dead. There's been two people each and every time that I check. So um, yeah, I don't know. I tried Guck A one night and got a group for 20 minutes. Um, and then they had a guild member that came um to take my spot. Um, which was fine. They were really upfront with me about how, you know, as soon as their guildmate got there that I was going to have to leave the group, which was fine. Um, I unfortunately do not know Guck well enough to be able to find my way around there and it took me forever to find them. So uh, that cut down on the amount of time that I was able to group with them as well. So, but um, yeah, so I'm going to have to try to figure out where to go from here um, as far as where I want to hunt to find a group um, if either of those zones that I just mentioned don't really pan out I made um, solo my way up to like maybe 23 or 24 and then uh, go over to high keep go down into high keep and try to find a, a group there but um, yeah Let's do one more before I leave. Yeah, and with these, they have been resisting like nobody's business. Um, I had one a little while ago that even resisted one of my uh, my careless lightnings, which is a I think it was a level 19 spell. Um, 
so that can sometimes get a little hairy. But um, like I said before, mostly unless they they decide to add on, um, it's pretty easy. It's pretty relaxed. Um, the experience is really good. Um, I'm definitely excited for level 24 and getting a new dot because uh, as nice as the uh, the stinging swarm is, it's 13 every tick is starting to take quite a while to uh, get get these guys down. Um, I mean the mana hit has become less, so the as long as I don't get into too much trouble and have to cast too many direct damages, um, I'm left with about 50% mana, which isn't too bad. Um, so the med time isn't bad, but uh, it'd be nice to be able to do more damage over time. go for spider silks and uh, not too bad experience wise I'm already just a little bit away from 70 until uh, next level which is not too bad so hopefully if not tonight then tomorrow I'll get in the next level and uh, let's see here I'll be two away from my next level spells. So, um, yeah. Thank you guys for watching, and, uh, if you'd like, leave a like, and, uh, I'll talk to you sometime later.